Broadcasting from Ken Island High School on Wednesday, February 1st, this is your Buck Report. Let's get started. First up, let's talk about today's events and meetings. Today, our USC Districts Tournament was a huge success. Of course, we won grandly. A fabulous time was had by all the participants. Next up, states. Adding on to their previous three-game winning streak, our men's basketball team beat St. Michael's 74-61. to Their next game is Colonel Richardson for senior night. The women's team, on the other hand, was barely able to hold on to their undefeated record, only beating St. Michael's by 90 points. Yes, you heard it that right. They beat St. Michael's 94-4. to Great job, Bucks. Today, our hockey team will host the first of their senior nights for this week. Their hockey game will will be at Penny Orchard Ice Rink beginning at 4 p.m. They will be competing against St. Mary's. Additionally, our wrestling team will be competing at North Carolina High School. NCHS is a short drive away and their meet begins at 5.30. Good luck to all of our Bucks. Welcome to our first Wellness Wednesday. As you are aware, one of our expectations is to be responsible. Being responsible is an act of wellness because it helps you keep yourself accountable. Here are tips to help ensure that you are being responsible in your daily life. Set clear goals for yourself. Reward yourself when you achieve positive results, but don't beat yourself up if you don't. When things get challenging, remind yourself of your past accomplishments and review your goals and track your progress towards reaching those goals regularly. We all have the responsibility of being a good student which includes completing assignments on time, turning them in, and studying for tests. However, we also have a lot of responsibilities outside of school. Today, take a few minutes to share with your teacher the things you are responsible for outside of school. A representative from the Army will be here today at all lunches to answer any questions you may have regarding the possibility of joining the Army. Be sure to stop by and say hi and learn more about what the Army has to offer. Saga members, there will be a meeting after school today in room 255. Hope to see you there. Bonjour! Come join the French Club tomorrow in room 105A for French food, music, and conversation. For more information, please contact Madame Pantusa. Next Wednesday, we are going to have a Money for College financial aid night which is going to be held here in the auditorium at 5 30. this is open to everyone especially i want juniors to come out to this along with their parents to understand some of the opportunities that you will be applying for later on after high school and this money can go towards college community college trade schools lots of things there's lots of information so i highly encourage everyone to turn out the Ken Island Elks donated items for the Giving Closet. If you're in need of a lunch bag or a cinch bag, come down to the guidance and grab one. There will be a football interest meeting immediately after school tomorrow. It will be a very short meeting, Coach Sof's room 262. Please schedule a ride home after the meeting. Please see Coach Sof if you have any questions. Tomorrow is the annual Science Trivia Night. This year, we have Chick-fil-A and other prizes on the line, including spray tans, rounds of golf, and other gift cards. Many donations have been contributed by the community to make this science night a success. Be here tomorrow at 6 p.m. with a team of between two and five people. All ages are welcome, including parents and siblings. We hope to see you there. More and more college majors require you to take economics. Why not take it in high school, where you'll have one-on-one -on -one help from the teacher and the support of your friends? Considering it but don't know the difference between microeconomics and macroeconomics, well, taking both would be best-case scenario to understanding it all. But if you have to choose one, macroeconomics looks at the larger picture, foreign exchange, real GDP, the role of the central bank, etc. Microeconomics looks at small-scale economics, how the decisions of individuals and single business matter, types of market structures like perfect competition and monopolies, analysis of business decisions between the short and long term, etc. Also, this course is a must for anybody thinking of opening their own business one day. See you next year. That's all the time we have today. Have a great day and we will see you right back here tomorrow. Have a great, great day, day, Bucks. Bucks.